Hi there, fourth graders. Welcome back to Ready, Set, Read. As you know, I'm Miss Graves, and I am so excited that you are here with me today. Today's episode will be a writing mini lesson that will teach us a new writing skill we can use when we write about the rock cycle to finish out our learning for this week. But before we get started, let's make sure you have gathered all of the materials that you need today to be successful. You're going to need your week four distant learning packet, a pencil, and some scrap paper. I'll give you 10 seconds to get those things together, get organized, and get ready to learn. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Great. If you have all of your materials, give me a thumbs up. Awesome. Let's get started. All week, you have been learning about the rock and rock cycle. Our goal for today's show is to show all the amazing things you have learned about the rock cycle through writing. To help us do that, we are going to learn a new writing skill. Then we'll practice it. Then We'll try it out in our writing today. We've learned that strong writers use transitional words like because, but, and so to help connect their ideas and make their writing smoother. We've also learned that transitional words can be used to introduce ideas at the beginning of sentences, to link ideas within a sentence, and to unify sentences or paragraphs. Today, we are going to learn how to use transitional words to show something else. And that's gonna be opposing ideas or different, two different ideas. Let's warm up our brains together by reviewing some familiar transitional words before we jump into our new words. We'll begin by expanding a sentence with a transition word that we already know, because, or the word because. And I know you all know what the word because means because you use it a lot. The word because means why, right? So, or tells us why something happened. So let's finish our sentence. This sentence begins by saying the rock cycle is important because, so we need to finish it by explaining why the rock cycle is important. Watch how I use what I learned from our text this week to expand this sentence. My expanded sentence says, the rock cycle is important because it is a never ending process that continues to shape the earth by creating and destroying rocks on the earth's surface. Did you notice how I used the transition word because to explain why the rock cycle is important? Now we're ready to look at some new transition words that will help us with our new skill. Acknowledge or showing different or opposing ideas in our writing. These transitional words will be important to use in opinion, argumentative, and compare and contrast writing. We call these type of transitional words change in direction transition because they help us express contrasting or differing or different ideas in our writing. Here and in your packet, you will find a list of change of direction transition words. Let's read them together. You ready? The first word is however. The next word is even though. The next word is in contrast. The next one, otherwise. 
On the other hand, although, but, yet, instead, and the last word is on the contrary. Wow. So all of these words help us to show differing ideas when we are writing. Are you ready to see some change of direction, transitional words in action? Let's go. Okay, fourth graders, follow along as I read aloud these sentences. Keep your eye out for the transition word. Major events such as volcanoes erupting, earthquakes and erosion may seem random. However, these changes are all part of a pattern. Let me read it one more time. Watch, look for the transition or the change in direction. Major events such as volcanoes erupting, earthquakes and erosion may seem random. However, these changes are all part of a pattern. So how did I use the transition word to connect these two ideas? Well, it seems like these two sentences are connected by the fact that they show opposite ideas. When I read both of these sentences, I think it seems like these events are random, but they are actually part of a pattern. I know the word however can be used like the word but because it shows a change in direction. So I used the change of direction, transition word however, to start that second sentence. Now let's practice using another new transition word together. Let's expand this phrase into a sentence. Although many geologists study the rock cycle, I noticed that one of our new transition words, although, is at the beginning of this sentence. Although is a change of direction transition word, so this tells me that the next part of this sentence will have to tell a contrasting or opposing idea. Think back to what we have learned about geologists and the study of rocks. Can you think of a contrasting idea that you could use to expand this sentence so that it is still true but expresses two different ideas? Let you think about that for a few seconds. Hmm. What is something else that was true about geologists that I can add to expand my sentence? I got it. Here's what I wrote for my contrasting idea. Although many geologists study the rock cycle, there is so much to be learned. In my sentence, the transition word although showed that geologists already study and know a lot about the rock cycle, but there is still a lot more we can learn about the rock cycle. Did your sentence show two different ideas? Great job. Now it's your turn to practice using change of direction transition words. Choose the transition word that would show a change of direction between these two ideas. Some events in the rock cycle occur over millions of years. Other events like volcanic eruptions happen quickly. Which of the transition words in the word bank could you use to show that these are differing ideas? Should we check our answers? Let's do it. I picked the word yet 
as the transition word to connect these two sentences. Let me tell you why. Okay, so the first sentence tells how the rock cycle can change the earth very slowly. But the second sentence talks about how it can change the earth very fast. So these two sentences are expressing opposing ideas. To connect opposing ideas, I know that we can use change of direction transition words. I selected yet because it is a transition word that expresses differing ideas, like the two ideas about the rock cycle. How did you do? Did you pick yet to connect the sentences? I know you've been working so hard and are ready to start using change of direction words in your writing today. And I also know that you are gonna do a great job with it. So what are we going to write about today? Well, for today's writing assignment, you will use everything you learned from your research of the rock cycle to write an essay describing how the rock cycle works. You will include details about each type of rock. Remember those? Sedimentary, igneous, and metamorphic, and how they are created. And make sure you include evidence from the text to support your response. Okay, so just like last time, you will use one of these organizers to plan your writing. You can choose option A or B. You only have to do one. Be sure to use the one of these organizers to plan out each part of your writing. And here is the student-friendly checklist that shows all the features or all the things you should show or include in your writing. You will want to use this today like you do every time you write an informational piece to make sure that you have included each component or each one of these things in your writing. Are you ready to write? Before we sign off, let's review exactly what your next steps are. You can also find these in your packet. First, you'll plan your writing in one of the organizers. Then you will draft your response using your completed organizer. Once you're done drafting, you'll edit and revise your writing. And last, you will show off your work by presenting it to a family member. That's the part I really wish I could see. And remember to use our new writing skill today by using at least two change of direction transition words in your writing to connect two contrasting or differing ideas. I know you're gonna do a great job answering this writing prompt about the rock cycle because fourth graders do what? Fourth graders rock. So I know that your paper is gonna rock and I know that you are gonna do a great job. Okay, thank you so much for joining me today, fourth graders. Do well with your exit ticket and I will see you next week at this same time for another lesson. Bye.